You're watching WCIA3 Sports with Brett Barrons. Friday football fever is back. Week one game set to begin even with multiple delays due to heat. More than two dozen pushed back, including our spotlight game of the week between Prairie Central and Unity. And that's where we find WCIA3's Bryce Beeman live. Bryce, a little warm out there. You stand cool. <laughs> Brett, I, you know, I don't think I'm staying cool. I'm pretty hot out here, but like you said, here at Unity for the Spotlight Game of the Week against Prairie Central, joined with Unity head coach Scott Hamilton. Coach, talk to me. How do you prepare your team for this kind of heat? Uh, you know, we've just tried to do, make the best of the week, and um, we practiced at 7 o'clock every night, and uh, we were able to get outside for, you know, an hour and a half um, each night. And, you know, the kids did a great job of being focused through those times. So, you know, we obviously were shorter than what we wanted to be, but um, we were able to get some good work done. Prairie Central beat you guys week one, but you guys beat them in the playoffs. You know, what is that kind of mentality to get that win week one against them today? Yeah, you know, I don't know. Matt Brown's not here with me today, and some of those guys, uh, you know, our defense that was so good for us last year, you know, all those guys, but one of them are gone. So, you know, I don't know that any of that means much. Um, you know, they've got a new team. We've got a new team. Um, you know, and we'll, uh, you know, we'll, we'll try to figure out how we can play our best tonight. All right, Scott, thanks so much, and good luck today. Thank you very much. I'm also joined with Prairie Central head coach, Mike Goodwin, first-year head coach here at Prairie Central. I know you have lots of years of experience, but you just got off a bus yeah. for over an hour. Talk to me about just that ride, and how do you prepare your guys to get hydrated for this game tonight? Well, it, it, we sure liked when we got on the interstate and there was some wind because, you know, the yellow limousine doesn't have any air conditioning, but we forced them all to drink a bottle of water on the way down, so... We've been hydrating all week, and like Coach Hamilton said, we were practicing late, so hopefully we'll be ready for it. Unity got that win, playoffs. You guys beat them week one last year. What is kind of the mentality heading into this game? Uh, you know, I think we're just looking to – our kids want to play a game, and, you know, to that point in the season, we got to find out what's broken before we can fix it. So, obviously, it's a pretty big deal between the two schools, but, you know, it's just a football game is what we've been telling the kids. All right, Mike. Thanks so much and good luck. Thank you. All right. We're going to try to stay cool here right now. The temperature on the field is at 89 degrees. We'll see if it continues to get lower. It's just 92 at around 530. So it continues to drop. We'll see if they play today at 8. Reporting in Tolono, I'm Bryce Beeman, WCIA 3 Sports. Bryce, maybe we get you a yellow limousine there, a school bus. That was great. Thank you so much.